so beautiful to see all of you with your beautiful faces starting the new year. Hmm. Blessed to be able to start this new year with all of you. And my co-luminary here, I'm sure you all know Karina Shaha. She is, <laughs> she is a guiding light. <laughs> And I just want to appreciate her and just show my gratitude for, for having this, this being, this soul in my life and, mm. and to be able to share it with all of you. So <clears throat> today is a powerful day. Happy New Year. And I'm going to hand it over to Karina. Karina, again, before we start, I just, I bow. I bow to you and I appreciate all that you are really calling each and every one of us to at this moment during this time. So thank mm -hmm. you. I honor you. Oh, thank you so much, Demetria. Um, back to you 10,000 fold or more and all of you as well. Thank you so much. And welcome to the new you in this new year, in this new moment right here, right now that's so alive with just the preciousness of your breath and your being. Can we just take this moment just to center in and thank ourselves for coming through hindsight 2020 and into 2021. Um, even in this Julian calendar, uh, calendric year, uh, we can also thank and bless all the ancient calendars that follow along with the rhythms of the universe. But for now, we're in this particular uh, time frame, And let's just thank and bless this moment where we are here with each other and just honoring <clears throat> this heart and this being and those that are with us, those that are far away, those that are near and dear in our hearts. And we just place our hands if we so choose just right in this what we call this um, central focusing place within the body and being just to give ourselves this moment of thanks in wonder in beauty of the begin beginning in this that is every breath is a beginning and every release of breath is allowing the vapor of our spirit of the indwelling presence to re, to evolve and revolve and attune into the presence of this space that we are. And as we arrive in this moment, this true divine being that we are, that we already are, and perhaps in our lifetime, we have wandered through many corridors of, of awareness, of thought, of activity, of being. And in our explorations, we have collected and recollected and created, designed, dissolved, fallen, become lost, gone through periods of wandering and wandering. But let us call all of that beautiful experience that we call being into our heart now, breathing this in, the vapor and the spirit of the experience of being in a form, in a vibrational field. And we can remember from some great sacred texts, in the beginning, there was the word, the word, the vibration, the field of consciousness that brought us into this form from the formlessness. And in the awareness of this, as we breathe in and give thanks and welcome. Welcome. Welcome to all that is here. All that I am. Those two words, I am. Feel how those words as we breathe in, as you so choose, if you do, to breathe in to that which is. 
<sighs> releasing with the sound of awe, which is the sound of the heart. Ah, a centris, centering focus, a centralizing focus. I am, and then what follows? With that, in these two words, I am, is the whole of creation force so beautifully crafted? We can return to a native or a known language that suits us, we can say those words in our own mother tongue. Or we can silently say them within our own being. Here I am, available and open to receive. As the light that comes and descends that is always here, available to nurture the seed of our being, to bring forth nectar from the blossom of our presence, and to assist in the germination and maturation of our being. And being is the seed, the form from the formless. And our breath is the connecting link and when we choose to breathe consciously, when we become aware of the breath, the writ, the spirit, the source, we come to realize a great power and presence in the very act of a deep, abiding and devotional breath. A breath that is filled with the effulgent, shining nature with the welcoming call of the gift of our being. And in this moment of I am, we give the call of the rise of this saying, I am available here to receive, to bring in this, this sweet, delightful and powerful light that is calling to us from all dimensions and into this form just for this moment, center in to this breath, this being, this knowing. And lo, though I have wandered and wondered and sought and searched and seeked and longed, my curiosity, my awe in this wonder, gazing to, the, to that which is the star brothers and sisters, the light that pours through the sky at night, or the early morning rise of the earth, or the earth as it sets, seeing this logos body, solar presence that inhabits our world and brings forth great flourishing of light, the food and the nourishment of our being. May this search return back to this moment, to this great and mighty I am. For as you entered into a form and prior to arrival, there is a moment of the incarnation of this soul. And there in the loving arms as you are presented into the world, there was a name that was given from the birth parents or thus of others. But in the echoing of the chamber of creation, you heard that calling you knew that it would bring forth many blessings and experiences. And so that name that called forth that is now the birth name of your name is echoing through the chambers of your heart. And with that name and that nature, so too came this great incarnation of your being. And so as we hold fast to this great embrace, and deeply we go. May we feel the vibrational field of our given name, our birth name. Thanking and blessing the mother line, the womb of that fruit of nature that came forth through you, you too. And that the father line, the seed 
that developed and brought forth this blessing of thee, the merging of this in a vessel of being in a vibrational field that came, that is present here now, I am. And the name that follows in the breath that is breathed through the temple, breathed through the echoing call of the mission, the vision, the decree, the message of your being, the dispensation and its method of delivery. Just know dear hearts right here, right now, that that name and your relationship to it, the I am and the name of your incarnation. And perhaps maybe you have changed that name into a name that is true for you. Or maybe you have received the vibrational name of the spirit source of all that you are. But that original blueprint of being carries with it all the aspects of being that you are and many lifelines and lifetimes and frequencies. The singing body hears that name. And all the angels and all of creation and all the masters and all the gods and goddesses and all the pantheon of all being, when that name is sung out through your being, there is a great moment of reckoning. There is a beauty in that sounding. So here in this moment, as we begin this new frequency, we welcome you into this circle as we ask you to gently call forth the name in the nature of your being in your relationship with it. Breathing in now if you so choose and feeling the sound of your own name echoing through frequency and vibration, this nature, this knowing, this awareness, softly and sweetly, deep within, something rises up, a rehearting and a reminding of the grace that is within all being, the grace within the very essence of the Immaculate Heart that chose that sweet name and said, unfold, open, so that we may experience this divine nectar of your being. And so you came and you are here now. I'm here to receive the blessing of this and anointing of that frequency that which is at the feet and the foot of the being and that which rises up through the crown. Where we stand, we stand on hallowed ground. When we embrace in the nature of that which is, may we now in our being know this as truth no matter what the relationship is with birth mother or birth father, there is an original, all that is, indivisible, immutable, inviolable, intact, whole and holy. And it says to thee, I am here and I am loving. I am loving every aspect of your being all that I can see and all that I am and all that I witness within me is the very beloved presence that is. This indivisible, totally whole and holy witnessing of our being is here for us right now. Beloved ones, with the inner eye unveiled unto this, so do the eyes of our physical form begin to see as all perception becomes conception and all the senses are raised up in this which is known as I am and is said unto thee, I am here for thee. 
you are seen, you are witnessed, and you are honored in this moment of all moments. Breathe into this if you so choose, as we bring forth sacred sound to honor this welcoming in, this beauty and wonder of thy being. The hand of your heart is touching the heart of your hand and the soul of the blessing of your being, the hand of the heart of all that is reaches inward and says unto thee this blessing, O beloved one, look at you in this moment, in this breath, brand new, eternal, infinite. Welcome, welcome. Hearing the name and the name and the nature of thy being. gaze in the abiding it sits can you meet this gaze of wonder to behold can you allow yourself in the greatness of the source of your being to be seen fully feel the gaze of this that says I am here and you are seen you are loved in the wholeness and the sweetness of this. I am whole, indivisible, and within thee all that is whole and indivisible and holy. I am loving and I am loved and that which you may receive this now. Feel this in your being as it flows through all the cellular matrix, all the divine circuitry that is lit up with the praise of your breath, of your being shining in its true divine nature to be witnessed, to be seen, to be held, to be gazed within as one gazes within. The eyes of all that is, the heart, of all unknowable truth, the soul of all being, infinite mystery within this moment, woven of the threads of all presence together now, within and surrounding you. Breathe in this love, Breathe in this indivisible truth. Breathe in this glorious moment. Dimensions within dimensions, consciousness within consciousness, enfolded and enfolding. A smile of a billion, trillion suns glory in the light of starlight of masters within masters, beings within beings, a gazing through one, all, many. To you this gift is offered as you offer this through every breath you breathe. the prana in the presence, the life force that rises and the light force that descends and therein in the center of all this 
is this moment. Namo Atiya Ahangayo Jaya Jaya Ha Jaya Ha We asked at the beginning of this transmission to come in contact with your birth name. All the differing symbols carrying forth the symbology of the mission and vision of your being and how they align up and line up. And no matter what name you have now, know that in the moment of your inception, prior to leaving source, all that is, there was a secret name imbued and woven in the inner enfolding of the very heart of your heart. And that name carries the vibrational field of all experience, known and unknown, seen and unseen within thee. It is the name that Source Divine calls you forth in those moments of the dark night of the soul, in the moments of the blazing light of the illumination of your being, therein the sacred sweet sound of silence bringing forth the blessedness of the tears of grace that fall from the tree of life. The seed of your inner knowing is there, the innermost secret place of the highest. Just as I am establishes a domain of creation so too the secret wonders of the beauty of that which is innermost calling inward this now to fall into the arms of grace and silence and to feel embraced and enfolded and to know that you are encircled within this as beings of the being of you surrounding the warmth of the arms of all creation, welcoming us in, in this divine embrace. As we are cradled in this light of this innermost mystery, the name and the name and the nature of all that ill is that flows through the blood and the bone and the sinew embodied in the form that walks and breathes and be the consciousness that arises and arrives. The actions, the deeds from the seed every aspect, every part, in every dimension. Feel the wonder and beauty of this now. Bow down to the greatness of the space that is upheld at all times within. That which we bow down to bows down to us. For we are in the greatness of the abiding in the resting, in the softening. In the sweetness, the gentleness, and the mighty power of being here and now for all to see. May we unveil as we are unveiling within this innermost mystery. The nameless silence that flows through us all. Feeling this now in our heart and our being.
and as we feel into this, if we so choose. Welcoming this gift that resides at the very core of the core, the heart of the heart. Breathing this through now. is that which unveils and that which we unveil. We know that in the experience of our living, from the day-to-day -day naturalness, from that which unfolds in our daily practice of being here, it is unfolded and woven through so that no matter where we are, what it is that is unfolding in our lives, from our time in our workplace, our home life, our family, to the making of a bread, a piece of nature unfolding, to a meal for those we love, to time alone, centering in space and meditation, to going about our day-to-day -day business of life. Every aspect of it is enfolded and unveiled in this the naturalness of our being. We do not have to set aside a time to be within this because we are enfolded within it at all in presence. No matter where we are, what we are feeling, thinking, who we are conversing with, what is unfolding or coming through this vessel of the mouth that speaks, the mind that knows. And even in our moments of confusion and loss, just know. It is always ever present in every breath we breathe, in every moment we are here. In every moment we unveil unto this love, unto this act of creation, unto this body, being, and vessel, unto the very name and nature that we are. We are in this light of love. We are vehicles of consecration for love in its purest form is ultimately consecration to make holy what is already whole and to bring it back into the source of our being and breathe in the vapor and the spirit of the very act of our being, the alignment of our soul, the connection to all that we are and the beauty, the wonder, the power, the light, the delight, the joy, whatever one invokes in one's life, the story and the history and the her story of our being is within that moment of all moments. So that when I am is invoked and words that follow, so too do we know we are the makers and the creators of that which is within our sight and before within our being and what we see and what we enact and what we know and what we believe is flowing through. So we have command by being present and ever present in this field. So we ask now in the very depths of our being with the I am that begins and whatever you invoke after to know that the spirit of this word 
shall be carried forth through your being, the breath and the vapor of it. And like a seed, it shall flow through all of your experience. So we ask you now in the quietness of the mystery of your being to bring forth an issuance from the very heart of that mystery, the silence of the name, the secret place, the innermost of your being. I am. And as the word forms through and passes through the lips and out into this field and sphere of awareness, slow down the consciousness awareness and breathe in the vapor of the words spoken. I am grace incarnate. I am that I am. These are the words of our choosing. Breathe in. I am. Say forth. Feel the words. Feel the impact. Feel the vibration like a tiny pebble dropped into a calm, cool pond, watching the ripples ripple out. Breathe back in the vapor of the word, the power of speech to invoke, to create. Know that within thee, in the very name and the nature of all that you are, you carry forth this consecration, this feeling, this flow, this knowing. And now we pass through into sound for thee as you may continue with your practice of this I am and the sacred word that flows from your lips and the breathing back in, the vapor of its inner knowing, if you so choose.
breathe in this vapor, this spiritus sanctus, and breathe through this out and in. Come into the rhythm, to the alignment, to the mystery, to the enfolded presence, the inner glow, the feeling, the knowing. Ah. <sighs> We are met by this gaze. We are met by this breath. This is a meeting of all aspects in one. We share this gaze with thee now. This smiling heart. Hmm. <laughs> welcome, welcome, beautiful one, wondrous being, welcome home here. <laughs> Breathe in this, all that we are. You wish for healing and harmonization. Here so shall it be here. Gaze and abide, know all. Welcome. Welcome. <clears throat> you wish to know the wonders and secrets of the universe right here <sighs> in this moment, all is revealed. The eyes of the heart seen through immaculate presence. <laughs> Welcome. Gaze. Whatever is calling in your being to be revealed, you have the power and presence in your being if you so choose. Enact this, open unto it, Allow to be seen. Acknowledge the gift of who you truly are. Look at the marvel, marvel of this creation glowing with light. <laughs> what have these hands created through the consciousness of our being? Ah. 
how they can be filled with such warmth, such tenderness, such gift of giving. <sighs> how they can weave and give and move. Our whole body is a living, singing frequency. What a marvel of creation. <laughs> Our eyes take in light and reflect light. Sound comes in and goes out. Oh, behold this temple, this beautiful testament to a divine knowing presence, a mystery deep within me. We gaze, we honor, we rest, and we abide with thee. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank all. May you breathe this in in all lifetimes, in all lineages, in all incarnations. And may you know that whatever you speak through the gesture, through the embodiment, through the vibration of your being, it is known and it is felt and it is recognized and it is seen and it is honored right here, right now. It is natural to be always this way, to be open, to be trusting, to be filled with this radiant immaculate presence. This is who we truly are. It takes a lot of pressure and a lot of training to close this vibrational field down. But now if we choose, Always, in all ways, we can, we will, and we are this vibrational testament to that which we carry truthfully, wholly, abiding within us, resting as this. And it takes no effort. It is filled with the grace of the source of all that is in your eyes, your being, your light, your whole vessel shines with it. And we are so deeply grateful and thankful and honoring to be here with you all now. Thank you from our heart to yours. Bring this gift into your heart and breathe through its beauty. <sighs> Let the smile of your true inner nature shine forth and through. 
And if there have ever been any moments less than the perfection of your being, welcome them back in, let them dissolve and melt into this ever flowing font and stream of infinite praise. And if you've fallen and hurt and been overwhelmed and confused, welcome this back in and, and let it dissolve, bathe and be saturated in this welcoming joy of the shining effulgent nature. Wherever you are in this moment of being, just realize what you are who you are and how wondrous and profoundly powerful your very breath, your very being, the light that you carry, the love that vibrates your being, the blessing of your true nature. We uphold this and honor this in all ways. So be it and so it is. Thank you, dear hearts. I am Karina Shaha, known as Grandmother Alushama. May this blessing flow through into all your legacies, into all those that you love. And let us call into our circle now in the center of the heart of our hearts, our beloved planet, all of nature, our families, those that we love near and dear, those of our dearly departed, those that may be in resistance of the beauty and the power and the wonder of this. Whomever is resonating with us, just know you are welcomed into this circle of being. You may say their name deeply within your soul. May you call places upon this planet, wherever, in nature, in dimension, you are welcomed into this natural divinity that flows through all of creation. You are welcomed here. This is a welcoming place. My home and our home is open. Step in and feel the nurturance and the sustenance of this living light. Thank you, thank you everyone who has participated in this experience and expression and may it ripple out in innumerable ways and unknown mysteries in your life as the gifts unfold for you. And thanks to beloved Demetria, my beautiful co-host, for bringing us all together once again. In this moment, celebrate all that you are. Bring your hands into your heart center if you so choose. Take in a beautiful breath. Thank the great and mighty I am and all the power and presence that flows through all creation, all that is, this infinite mystery, the name and the namelessness of your being. Thank you. Ah. Ah. So be it, and so it is. Mm. Shake it all through, shimmer it all through. <sighs> Lift up your hands. <laughs> Let our hands feel the vibration, all our hands waving in the beauty of this moment. Feel the rippling call. It's a wave across the planet through our hearts and our being. Ah. Yes. Ah, thank you all. Hmm. 
<laughs> Thank you, nature. Thank you, Gaia. Thank you, God, Goddess, Source. Feel this beautiful feeling. Mm. In the tinkles of our fingertips. <laughs> oh. This beautiful power and presence together. Mm. So be it and so it is. Hmm. Over to you, Demetria, to close this beloved circle. <laughs> you gotta get yourself unmuted there, girl. <laughs> I'm at a bit of a loss for words here. Thank you. Hmm. I can just feel the, you know, the respite and the rest that not only for myself, but all the souls coming here, just really feeling the safety and the tranquility of this, of the love that really came through you um, today and always. Um, the love in your eyes, Karina, and I'm pretty sure I speak for everybody that really beamed through. Um, just felt, I like coming home. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I make no claims to anything. I just let that which needs to flow through, flow through in the moment. And we all have this capacity. It's every time we gaze from our inner heart and that inner mystery of the, the I am in that innermost place, you know how we feel when we see a first blossom come out in, in a garden or in a place? We see something so beautiful and we gaze into it. And it's reflected back through our own being. We can give that gaze to all beings. We can go to the bank tomorrow. We can do a deposit and we can just with our eyes. Because sometimes we're covered up here so that smile can't be seen, but our eyes know how to smile. And what we give, what we give, we receive in so many ways. Mm -hmm. And we know at this time of great transition, these beloved sources, windows of the soul, no matter how we choose to live our lives, if this happens to be covered up or not, just know these little peepers, <laughs> <laughs> they can peer through anything and they can pierce any illusion and bring truth through. So if this is our message for you today, thank you so much. Until we meet again. Until we meet again. <laughs> Namaste, lovies. <laughs> See you all soon. Love you, Karina. <sighs> Bye.